Hey everybody, it's Friday, March the 11th. Thanks for joining us today. Our uh, owner left a Pelican case in his office and, uh, you know, big Friday. We thought we'd shoot a fun video, so we thought we'd crack this bad boy open and see what it is. Um, you've probably heard about a bailout bag from the military or what's now referred to as a bug out bag, which is something designed to carry supplies and gear to get you through about 24 to 72 hours in a emergency situation. So this is our version of a bug out bag designed for tech, so a technical bug out bag. So it's our owners. Let's crack it. It's like a treasure chest for us and let's see what he's packing to keep him safe or going for technology over 24 to 72 hours. So first thing we noticed right away, pretty structurally sound Pelican case. These bad boys are pretty expensive so dollar amount I guess we're sitting in about a hundred to two hundred dollar range just for this. We're gonna start cracking this open. You know, it might be fun too if uh, if you have a bug out bag, let us know what you have in it, all your tech goodies. So, starting from the left, looks like we've got some FRS radios. This will be about three of them. I guess that'll come in handy since those are rather short range and don't require any licensing. Here we have a, hmm, looks to be a, a scanner, a unit and Bearcat scanner. Kind of interesting. Probably the antennas will be in here. Ooh, look at these bad boys. Go tennis, ah, oh, these are awesome. So if you've ever seen these, you buy these in pairs and what they essentially do are, they create almost a virtual network where you can set them along a waypoint and you can SMS, even if your cell phone or uh, let's say Blackberry, iPhone, anything runs out of reception, you can actually message and share uh, location tags, uh, maps and everything. And here's our antennas for, uh, for our systems. So that's cool, we got quite a few toys, that's neat. Oh yeah, Global Star Sat Phone. SRP on this is uh, about 600 Canadian. Sorry, 500 Canadian. Uh, the voice plan for a year with about, uh, well, probably about 600 minutes would be uh, about $600. So, very cool device, easy to use. Uh, let's see. Oh yeah. So we've got a FM transceiver. That's kind of neat. Oh yeah. Now what? What bug out kit, technical bug out kit would be incomplete without this? A crank radio. Man, that's awesome. Look at that bad boy. Yeah, have fun cranking that. All right. Let's take a look and see what else he's got in here. Keep in mind, again, this is, uh, this is what somebody has put together to keep them technical sound. Uh, GPS unit, a Garmin, and looks like this is uh, no network required, so you'll probably preload all your maps and everything ahead of time on that. Very cool. I guess we'll uh, we'll put that back the way he had it. And in here, let's take a look. Pretty neat case as well, from the looks of it already. Oh yeah, chargers. Okay, we're not gonna pop that open, but they're probably the chargers for everything that's uh, that's in the kit. So, bear with me now. What I'm gonna do is remove all of these goodies and see what's hiding on the second layer. So again, we've got FRS radios, we've got a Global Star sat phone, we've got a scanner, hand crank radio, we've got our mobile SMS network for your devices with antennas. We've got our Garmin, so everything so far, kind of neat, pretty expensive price tag. Oh yeah, look at this, so here we go. All right, so I'm assuming, oh, Gold Zero, this is pretty cool. Look at that, solar charger panels. So what would be complete when you don't really have any wires or anything to go with you? Solar power charging system, very cool. Make sure you have one of those in your, uh, in your bags. Let's see what's here. See, this is the fun stuff. If you're into tech like we are, it's always fun just digging through a, uh, a case to see what someone has. Oh yeah, okay, so more chargers on the go. Batteries, Duracells, etc. So that's your mobile power on the go. Again, in addition to your solar cells. And here's your power banks. Definitely a must. And these ones are very cool. If we can just pop that out. Look at that. Laptops, tablets, anything that requires um, a regular uh, US or Canadian outlet, AC, uh, USB. Type-C output, awesome. 
I wonder if I can figure out what what rating this is. Uh, wow, 20,100 milliamps. So two of these bad boys are sitting in this particular kit. So that's enough to get you through 24 to 72 hours, at least on most of your devices. And we got one more. Oh, here we go, another one. Awesome. So this looks like a four in one or a three in one. Let's see if it's charged. No, it looks like a flashlight and another power bank. This one, I can't really read it. My vision's not that good. There's actually a couple of those in there, so, oh, there we go. Better turn that back off. There we go. Very cool. Awesome toys. Awesome. Well, there you go, guys. Just unpacking a bug out kit, a tech bug out kit, rather, on a Friday. Just a fun video for you guys just to see. So listen, if you like the video, drop us a line. Let us know what you think. Let us know what you got in your bug out bag. We'd be curious to see if you've got a sort of tech savior bag in your closet or in your vehicle ready to go. And uh, we're always curious. We love technology. Thanks again for joining us. It's Mark from Back of Mobile. And uh, drop us a line. Uh, Facebook, Back of Mobile. Or at Twitter, at Back of Mobile. Have a great day.